Hey, this is Brian, and this is my last lecture. In this video, you'll see people that mean the most to me. These people helped me all through my four years of high school when I thought that I couldn't make it and I wanted to give up. These people was there for me, and I will never forget them, and I love them dearly. This one right here is like a second grandmother to me. Her name is Miss Neal. She taught me everything I know. But unfortunately, in 2016, she left the earth and went on to heaven. I love her and I miss her dearly. She's truly Oh, well, yes. I am playing Hannah Montana in the background. <laughs> but this is the only song that I found that was appropriate for what's happening next. So, right here is my cousin, Danielle. Many people don't know they were cousins, but we're actually blood cousins. And I am so grateful to have her. She has been there from the beginning. Like, I'm just so happy that I have a friend, actually a cousin, that goes to high school with me and been there since freshman year. And no matter what, she's always there right by my side. When I feel like I have no one else, I have her. She has kept me when I felt down. And I'm just so grateful to have her in my life. And I love her so much. As I said before, family is what helped me through high school. At this portion, you'll see a lot of pictures of me and my family. And these are the people that have been there from the beginning. And they love me unconditionally. I don't know where I'll be without them. They have supported me in everything. And they keep me pushing. When I feel like I want to give up, I know that they're counting on me. And I just love them for that. And family's always going to be there no matter what. I've had brick walls in my life, but family was always there to help me get through them. A main person you'll see is my god little brother. He's only one and a half, but he has helped me through so much already. When I want to give up, I look at him and he reminds me that I must keep pushing for him. He's the reason that I must live and make it through. The third day of senior year that morning, I wrecked my car. That had to be one of the scariest things I've ever experienced. Thank God I walked away only with a busty lip and some soreness. Yes, the car was gone, but I was alive and that's all that mattered. I've had a crazy ride through high school, but I'm glad to say that I've made it through it. I am now at the end of one chapter, and now it's time to start a new one, college. But always remember, family has your back when no one else does. The odds may have been stacked against me, but I made it to the end. We may encounter many defeats, but we must not be defeated. Maya Angelou. And you're about to see a video of my mom all through senior year. <laughs> How you doing your makeup and crying? How does that work? It was a waste of time. <laughs> it was. I can't tell me why. Don't even try to do your makeup. No. 